In this movie, we're going to take a look at some really helpful extras that'll improve your workflow, some of which we've already mentioned in previous movies, but they bear uh, repeating. The first is the use of the keyboard focus option. That's indicated by the A to Z icon. And this lets you do single letter key commands to execute um, some things that would require using tools or using shortcuts. And so for instance, the two most helpful keyboard focus um, commands in the edit window are to zoom in using T and zoom out using R. And that's done by placing the transport playhead somewhere and then it will zoom in and around um, the center of that. Now, you can also use uh, keyboard focus on different options such as the groups option, but that takes it away from the edit window. So you want to be sure that if you choose single key commands for groups that you re-enable that for the edit window or if you're working in the mix window. Another really helpful um, option is the ability to rename quickly inputs and outputs. Typically this is done by choosing setup in out and then you double click the name of an input so let's say these are vocals and in three and four are is rhythm and then you choose OK and when you look at the mix window you'll see your inputs vocals and rhythm well let's say you're working in a session you repatch the inputs and they're no longer no longer vocals but uh, they're guitars and you want to rename it quickly well, you don't want to go up to set up in out and repeat the process. Instead, if you've got a right button mouse, you can right click the input, choose rename, and give it a new name. And just as quick, you've got a new name for your inputs, and you can do this for your outputs too. So let's say my out one and two is a headphone mix. There you go. So that's a really quick way to rename inputs and outputs and it's really um, uh, just you know a, a great way to not get stuck having to go through multiple options when you're in the thick of creativity